It's so difficult to reflect on the darkest times in your life. Sometimes you gotta do that. I was fucked up. I mean, I hit rock bottom, but I make no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it, I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy, and go into rehab. I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. I'm truly sorry. What's going on, YouTube gang? It's your boy FYB Mark coming back at you with another video. And today we're going to be speaking on the situation on Diddy, bro. Because I take full responsibility of my act. Shut your bitch ass up, bro. Because if you take full responsibility of your actions, Go walk your ass down to the fucking police station, bitch ass nigga. Straight up, bro. Because you literally just sat up here, bro, on 4K, putting your hands on a fucking woman, bro. What you want my, what? What you got to say now? What you got to say now? You ain't got shit to say when you put your girl on the snap. Come on now, bro. Come on now. And the fact that a motherfucker would sit here and be like, well, Diddy said he's sorry. Man, I don't give a damn. The fuck is that supposed to mean? Just because another motherfucker sit on this damn internet and make a quick video talking about, I'm sorry, bro. I, I, I take full response. No, the fuck you don't. Because if you took full responsibility for what you did, bro, you would have sat your ass down. You would have. Went to counseling. You would have did all type of shit, bro. Now this shit coming out fucking years later. Now you want to take responsibility for the shit, bro. Get the hell out of here. That shit bogus as hell. The fact that you had this motherfucking woman under a blanket, all type of shit, bro. And then you want to talk about you. Man, you bogus as hell, Diddy. You bogus as hell, bro. This situation crazy. I don't know what to think about Diddy no more, bro. I already thought Diddy was, you know, on some some other stuff, bro. I'm going to keep it a buck. I already thought Diddy was in a whole nother lane, bro. But this, watching watching everything drop down on Diddy, bro, is crazy as hell, bro. Crazy as hell. You have way too many fucking allegations on your name, bro. And then I ain't even going to lie. If you honestly want to be real about the situation, let's think. All these allegations or are some of these true, bro? Because it do hit different when some of these is true and not all these is allegations. Let's start there. But it's your boy FYB Marman. I'm just giving y'all my thoughts in this situation with Diddy and him putting his hands on a fucking female, bro. On some real shit, G. Man, I hope Big Mike and Big Tony, bro, they throw that blanket over your head in that cell, bro, and get the welling on your ass. They have a blanket party with your ass, like the military do. It hit different, because you's a whole bitch for this, bro. Like, what the hell, man? But it's your boy, FYB Marvin. I'm just giving y'all my thoughts. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Y'all like, comment, subscribe, G, and I'm out. What? You on my what? What you got to say now? What you got to say now? You ain't got shit to say when you put your girl on the snap. It's so difficult to reflect on the darkest times in your life. Sometimes you got to do that. I was fucked up. I mean, I hit rock bottom. But I make no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. Disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. 
Now they're going to therapy. They're going to rehab. Had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. I'm truly sorry.